After all these years and everything that you and your wife have been through, how did it come to this? She insisted on having a separation and now that you've given it to her, she's cold, distant and mean. If you're feeling lost and like you don't recognize your wife, stay with me. By the end of this video, you're going to understand why she's acting this way and what to do about it. Let's dive right in. Why is your wife acting like she's fine? It's because she's already grieved the relationship. She's been more than likely unhappy for years and this separation can feel like a relief and like an escape from a really difficult situation. Don't make the mistake of believing that you don't matter or that the marriage didn't matter. That's not the case. It's just a reflection that your wife is further along in this process of grieving the relationship. Her cold demeanor is her way of trying to cope with a very difficult situation. We all have different coping mechanisms, which range from healthy to unhealthy. Now your wife is putting on a brave face and trying to avoid the gravity of the situation, which is an unhealthy coping mechanism. Now bear with me, I know you're thinking, I get all that, but how can it be that I literally don't recognize her? It's like she's got two faces. It's because you're experiencing two-face syndrome. To explain this phenomenon, I'm going to use a story from one of my favorite superheroes. <laughs> I'm Batman. In the movie The Dark Knight, there is a passionate and idealistic crusader for justice called Harvey Dent. He works alongside Batman as part of their campaign to rid Gotham of organized crime. His determination to uphold the law earns him the nickname Gotham's White Knight. After suffering the traumatic event of losing his fiance at the hands of the Joker, Harvey Dent becomes Two-Face, a villain twisted by the pain and injustice of losing his fiance. You and your wife used to be like the dark and white knight, working together to make the world a better place for you and your kids. But your wife's trauma from the marriage has turned her into two-face. She's blaming you for everything and is convinced that you are the villain. Your wife's decided to make you the villain subconsciously because it's the only way that she can justify to herself that it's okay to be so mean to you. Now what makes this situation more difficult is your wife feels the pressure to prove to her friends and family that separation was a good idea. To admit that this wasn't a good idea would tear her apart, so she's doubling down. Now I get it, her acting fine can make you feel ignored, rejected and angry. You might be thinking to yourself, if she doesn't care then why should I? But here's the truth, her behaviour is not telling you the full story. You're only seeing the surface. You're not seeing the deeper emotions that she may be hiding. And there's a real danger that by misinterpreting her actions, you'll take some decisions that you'll regret later. So what can you do? What steps can you take to navigate this confusing time without making things worse? Here are some actionable steps. Number one, work on yourself first. You've got to be like the dark knight and forge yourself in this fire. Use the separation as an opportunity to grow. Stop wasting your time and energy on trying to interpret where your wife is at and focus your attention inwards on mastering your emotions and your mindset. Now, while reconciling a troubled marriage can't be guaranteed, by doing the work and becoming a strong, magnetic, independent man with exceptional communication skills, you're gonna give yourself the best chance of healing your marriage. And worst case, if after doing all this work, your wife doesn't want to reconcile, you'll have the skill set to create a deeply intimate and loving relationship with someone else who deserves you. Number two, respect her process. She may not be currently in the space to open up and be vulnerable, and that's okay. Respect her timeline while staying present and focused on leading your family to the best of your ability. Number three, focus on understanding, not reacting. Stop assuming that your wife is unaffected. If she's acting like Two-Face, then you know that she is affected. Your marriage did mean something. Your wife just has all this pain right now and doesn't know how to process it, so she's projecting everything onto you. Try not to take this personally. This is ultimately your wife's pain, not yours. And if you can remain open and listen to what your wife is going through, over time, that anger and resentment will fade. I know this isn't easy. Watching someone you love act like everything's fine while you're going through hell is incredibly tough. But remember, her behavior right now is not the final word on your marriage. Use this time wisely. Work on yourself, improve communication, and don't give up hope until you've given it your all. And remember, this journey is about more than just saving your marriage. It's about becoming the man 
the father and husband that you were meant to be. So now that you understand why your wife is acting fine, you're going to want to watch this next video on the four principles of communication during separation.